what's going on everybody it's your boy dr Falls back here with another video so yeah man we're here to talk about some genshin impact so as you guys know i do still play the game often i just don't cover it as much on youtube because you know i've been playing the game for almost three years now and yeah man you know it's only so much you can do for this game but of course i've been um enjoying all the other gotchas i've just been playing so make sure you guys check those out but here we're talking about an interesting character, and this is also a character I've been waiting for so long to get. So I already do have my uh, Archon Squad. If you guys have been following me, I have uh, all 10, you know, Triple Crown Archons for all of them. So Venti, Jung Lee, uh, Raiden, and Nahida, I have the full Archon Squad. So of course I'm going to be summoning for Farina. And I've just been saving up a lot of free to play gems. I haven't summoned in ages. So I know I will be able to get her without spending any money because I don't spend any money in Genshin anymore. So, yeah, man, um, I'm going to get her and I'm just going to triple crown her just because. And then probably don't summon again for like another nine months. But yeah, man, one lie always follows another. And so justice awaits. Inescapably at the end, the ignorant see this as some kind of farce but if they can trace back to the source they've inevitably realized that they began by deceiving themselves a disordered fable left in someone's dream by mage n okay farina so we got farina herself title endless solo of solitude original of all waters kindreds peoples and laws so as we see the gnosis is hydro constellation in Melula Chiragi. So yeah, man, hydro icon is here. Drip marketing, uh, 4.2. So I'm glad that she is next, man. I was scared, you know, if they want to make her, um, you know, maybe 4.3, 4.4, whatever. But I just wanted to get her out of the way for Fontaine. Cause I already told you guys when they released uh 4.0 that I didn't really care about Lenny. I did not care about, um, uh, Nevelette who's coming out. And also Wesley the dude who's going to be using, you know, the ice fist. So I don't really care about those characters. So all of them is an easy skip. And a lot of people before that, all that, you know, before Fontaine was an easy skip. I don't just, you know, summon for nothing. But yeah, man, this is a character. I'm just using all my free to play gems to get. Uh, if I have enough, maybe we could go for the weapon. But it's not a priority at all. But yeah, man, Farina. Um, I wonder how she's going to play. But we do got the reveal, so I, you know, we can, you know, talk about you know, not really have to talk about speculations. We just know that she's next. But it's already got four mil, man. People are going to be eating this up. So let's go ahead and um go up here. As you can see, the splash chart here. Um, you know, we have um, you know, hydro there, and you know, it's pretty much the same thing I read. And it says, undoubtedly, Farina has been much loved by the people of Fontaine from the moment she became the Hydro Archon. Her charismatic uh, prelates, Wiley Wit, and Elegant Bearing. All, what is this? All, yeah, Elegant Bearing. All bear witness to the godly charms, but perhaps the thing is she's most revered for her unrivaled sense of drama. <laughs> I'm not going to read the rest of this because I don't want to bore y'all with that. But as y'all know, man, Farina. Very, very dramatic if you play, you know, four point on story. It's like she lives in the play. You feel me? But yeah, man. Also, we have Charlotte, who has also been uh revealed here on this list. Now, as you see, man, Charlotte is going to be cryo. Now, I don't expect, you know, too much for her, but I'm pretty sure she is going to be um a four star. So I'm pretty sure they'll probably have her. You know, it's one of those four stars that just do some random stuff and, and that's it. So without a doubt, you know, she's going to probably be on a um, a rerun banner <laughs> and they're just going to throw some people in there and she's going to be the future four star. I just hope they give her to everybody for free. I know they gave away, uh, you know, uh, Lenny's sister for free when 4.0 just started, but People shouldn't have to suffer something for Charlotte if they really like this girl. <laughs> so, you know, I wish everybody best of luck on these banners when they do come out. I know, uh, like I said, Neverlet comes out tomorrow, I believe, or Wednesday. I'm not sure what, what the time is. I don't keep up with it because, like I said, I'm not I'm not worried about it. But, um, you know, if you're something for Neverlet and anybody in 
uh, 4.1. I wish you guys the best of luck on that. But yeah, man, Charlotte is here. You phrased three days ago. One of your journalists secretly followed a suspect all the way to the quarter Fantine to a Roman time harbor and almost ended up being tied up and thrown into the sea by a gang of criminals. <laughs> I'm not going to read the rest of that part. But yeah, man, we'll have to see, you know, what they look like kit wise. Now, they got her in the photo here with this camera thing. And of course, you know, she's a journalist. So we'll see if she actually, you know, do some things with the camera. I think that'll be dope if they can incorporate some things as we see in Farina. She using a sword. So this is not that bad. Like I said, as long as it's not a pole arm, um, you know, I'm sick of pole arm impact. So yeah, man, her having a sword, I think it's going to be pretty dope. Uh, you know, if you're not going for certain things, depending on how she scales, I have a, a R5 sack sword. Maybe I know they got some HP selling swords that's coming up um, and some other things. So like I said, we'll, we'll have to see where the kit is and everything. But like I said, she's, of course, the high, most highly anticipated unit for Fontaine. Um, I still want to see when uh, Chlorine is going to come out. And also, I uh, can't remember her name right now, but the Geo girl. So, yeah, man, I can't wait for them to you know, also be revealed and probably see how they play or see what their kid is about. But like I said, it's just my, mainly the thing um, I just want to talk about today. I just want to ask you guys, man, you know, are you surprised or are you Want to be something for this unit or are you something for the, the bros in the beginning um i know some people collect just husbandos the husbandos up first and then now you'll be able to get like i said the hydro archon after their banners are done so for people who are not you know having a summon right now whether you long long primos or you just want to save maybe you want to save to be able to get the weapon too or something like that you have enough time to save too hopefully so hopefully you guys are able to save up enough so you'll have enough to summon for the character whether it's 50 50 or have enough to guarantee her if you lose so like i said i don't think um you know a lot of people um going to probably have have a lot but you had a lot of time to save so I tell everybody for any gotcha games that I play, you know, you don't have to summon every banner. You should always save on these games so you can have enough to get the character that you want. So that's why I'm always playing so many different gotchas and even being free to play on certain games. I'm able to get a lot of units that I want and enjoy the game because I can save for months and still summon and, and get the character where this guarantee or just winning 50 50 and then i have more until next time so you got to min max if you can make sure you log in do the daily events and then proceed so of course i'll be playing 4.1 when it comes out play the story do the events but i'm not going to just summon that's it so hopefully i have like i said a guarantee for farina i think i got maybe close to it and, and um you know i think i'll be good i'm not really fretting about it but yeah man can't wait to add her to the icon squad Mainly, I may just kick off uh, Venti or, or uh, John Lee. I don't really care about shielding like that. I really don't need them. But, um, yeah, man, i just I just going to play around with them. I think it's just going to be fun to use her in the squad. So, I know a lot of people are hoping that, um, you know, she works a lot with Hu Tao. I do have Hu Tao on my account and also with the Homa. I mean, if there are some comps that, you know, I can use her in that's not, you know, just playing around with the God Squad. Um, you know, I would gladly use her with Hu Tao and vape some people. So, yeah, man, Farina is coming. Let me know in the comments. Are you summoning or skipping? Are you waiting for Chlorine? Are you summoning for the bros? Let me know. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.